there are two mindsets one is to be optimistic the other one is to be pessimistic right now markets are pessimistic but we as investors should be optimistic there are a lot of opportunity that markets are creating for us and it's time for us to start looking at the opportunities than to think about the opportunity that we have been missing so welcome to stock market institute market wrap up this is kishore here i'll be talking about one of the very good opportunities that i see in markets today in future so the day's markets ended positive but initially the market was negative at end when market close nifty closed at around 259.62 points positive and nifty closed at around 76.65 points positive the day's news flipkart acquires clear trip 100% stake with this uh, it becomes a total flipkart or rather say walmart company but clear trip will continue to operate as a separate brand so it's exactly a company which belongs to walmart so walmart is now into travel business as well to put it in the other way around at the same time there is one opportunity that covid has created for us that is because of covid effect tata motors is running pune plant with a reduced workforce because of which the production of the vehicles will also be in a limited numbers so this gives us the opportunity to buy very good company shares at a discounted price so tata motors have been performing very well the cars have been getting very good response from people last month their sales were also very good so i would recommend you to look at this company with keen eye and start buying it in bits and pieces so that you can make good average and make best out of it lot of their good uh, well the most selling cars including the harrier safari everything has been manufactured at the pune plant so it gives us further more reason to look at this particular stock with a clear clean eye this is one of the good things apart from this audi takes over tesla and they have launched a suv electric suv at an entry level price which is much lower than what tesla's price is so this gives the opportunity for volkswagen the parent company of audi to compete with tesla and there are a lot of the lineup that they have in the electricity ve- electric vehicle space so this is one of the initial launches so going forward we may see a lot of other launches that volkswagen would do under the brand audi apart from this the other thing is uh, government would make mandate for the hallmark jewelry to be sold from june 1st so jewelers across india will be selling only 14 18 or 22 carat gold jewelry only they can't sell anything lower than this so this is a, one of the good things that government is doing apart from this uh, the other news is there is a brand called super k which is working hard in rural india because rural india retail is the next big thing and they are this particular company which is working hard and they just got a seed fund of almost 6 crores and they are bunch of youngsters who have started with this company so they aim to use this money towards infrastructure improving technology as well as hiring talent so i think this company would be promising so a lot of this e-commerce website may go forward and probably ha- take uh, take off this company or just buy off this company so let's wait and watch with regard to this particular company but super k is something which is promising top gainer for the day was tcs which went up by 3.7% and the same closed at 3218 rupees 95 paise and the top loser for the day was icha motors which went down by 3.26% and the same closed at 2411 rupees 65 paise apart from this gold right now is trading at 46786 rupees and the same is up by 178 rupees for every 10 grams silver also has gone up silver right now trading at around 67990 rupees is also up by 350 rupees for every 1 kilo usd inr usd also has gone up by 4 paise and it's trading at 76 rupees 36 paise euro also has gone up it's trading at 90 rupees 45 paise and the same is up by 49 paise apart from this petrol and diesel both have gone down thanks to government reducing it thanks to international crude price also that price has been reduced so each one has gone down by 16 paise for every 1 liter apart from this the crude oil i have added this from today because one of the viewer actually wanted this particular thing to be added so i have added crude crude also has gone down by 49 rupees and the same is trading at 4 4703 rupees the technical charts don't show any directions as such so we don't have to worry about it we just have to keep our eyes and ears open and see what global markets would be during the day based upon which we will be in a position to think what would happen in the markets tomorrow 
With this we come to end of today's market wrap up. Do like and subscribe the channel and share the videos amongst your friends so that more people get to learn and more people can learn. Thank you. Have a great day.